Hi, um, I want to make this section of the video about poverty to talk about more about poverty and illnesses, so why they are related. Because when you are poor, you can develop very serious illnesses. Well, I, I don't know all of them, but for example, you can get uh, uh, serious malnutrition, maybe you really lack of some nutrients, and maybe you can get, uh, you don't, you cannot um, go around because you don't have money for bus or for transportation and so you only can see at home maybe you only eat uh, bad food maybe only uh, unhealthy food with a lot of sugar maybe you get diabetes I got uh, I, I cannot eat too much sugar now and I think it's something like diabetes because I couldn't have um, good uh, I couldn't have very healthy food for some months and, and I only eat uh, unhealthy food because it was the one which was available to survive. So I think this is one of the biggest problems um, uh, all over the world, even in Africa. Many children have malnutrition and they get very huge bellies because they, they have their malnutrition. And many, many, many people have anemia. Uh, aside from being vegetarian, vegan, but they have anemia also because they can't afford maybe um well proteins and the food with iron which may be um meat but i don't eat meat because i'm a pescatarian or maybe it can be um legumes so maybe you don't have money for a good diet and you have many uh, you are malnutrited or you have anemia or other problem you are deficient in in some nutrients so i think this is one of the biggest problems or even starvation even you don't have in Africa, they don't even have water to drink. In some maybe in still in some countries, although now maybe it's better. And so, um, so um, of course you don't have money to pay for the bills, for the for your health, and you have to keep some health problems for very long. And um, for example, I couldn't do an allergy test, and I still can't do an allergy test. And so um, you have to accept that you don't have money to pay for in, in important things and then you need to find other ways to deal with these things you don't have money with. Maybe you need to read online information if it is something which you, you can solve by yourself. If it is not, then maybe you can use GoFundMe or those platforms and don't use Litchi because Litchi they will block your money and you won't see your money anymore. So, um, yeah, so I think that uh, poverty is linked to illnesses and you can heal yourself and you probably will get malnutrition. And uh, some people I, I know from Invisible People, which I really like as channel, and some people even got septicemia. Se sep uh, sorry, but I, I'm Italian. <laughs> They, they got like infection all over their blood because they couldn't, you know, they lived, they were homeless and they are even, uh, actually it's illness because some people, homeless people are even hit when they are on the road trying to sleep by other people so they get some illnesses so this is why poverty and of cures poverty is linked to illnesses because there is exploitation Maybe you work a lot and you're underpaid. Uh, anyway, you work a lot. And this, um, um, maybe for some people, they get some lung, lungs problem. They get some health problem. They get stress, depression, and health issues, you know, cortisol, and the, the body is weak. And there are, uh, and of course, you can't get uh, health uh, bills paid, so your health may deteriorate. So there are many reasons why um, uh, poverty is linked to illnesses and worse and illnesses, malnutrition, and many many problems. So um, you shouldn't watch like uh, a poor person because the poor person is suffering a lot. So we should rather be compassionate and understand them rather than or oh, a poor person, you know. You should you should be nice with poor people because they're already suffering a lot and. Let's see you on the next section.